Hey guys, what's up? Kodak the Wolf here. I'm going to be doing a, a different kind of video today. Uh, I wanted to do a video real quick on Ring of Elysium. Uh, I like this Battle Royale. It's one of my favorite ones I play when I'm not streaming or not playing PUBG. Um, the gameplay, the gunplay in it, I find to be a little bit wonky and uh, unpred like, unpredictable, I guess, sometimes. But overall, I still think it's a great game. And they just announced that they're releasing a new map, which I'm really stoked about. Uh, it's a, it looks like a kind of like a deserty island type map. Um, and uh, right off the bat, the first thing that I notice is this big volcano up here. It's uh, implies that the volcano will erupt and that lava could start flowing over the map, and that could be the new circle instead of the snowstorm, which I think would be a cool change because it would uh, still keep the environmental factor of the game alive and the randomness of the circle probably, and not just like a straight circle would be like a random zones being affected again. Um, which would be cool. I also think that uh, they probably will keep the same idea with like the classes on the snow map, but instead of, you know, they'll probably have like a gliding, gliding one, and there's a lot of mountains, so I could see them still having like a rock climbing class. But instead, um, I've been reading like what other people are thinking and uh, what could it, what could be, and a lot of people are saying that they think it could be like, like the new class could be like a mountain board. Like one that you strap in and go down the hill on, or even like a long board, um, which would be kind of cool, or like a BMX bike class, something like that. Something that you can use, you know, on the flat surfaces, but also could like go down the hills, which would just add like a cool new way to travel around the map. And they already said that they're coming out with a new way to travel. Um, my personal favorite would be probably the mountain board. I think the mountain board would be so cool to see with like big tires, but a BMX bike or a long board would be cool too, um, or even like a motorcycle. Uh, the other thing that's kind of different about this map is they have a lot of water. Uh, so, like, a lot of boats are going to spawn, if you look, like, through here. Um, so, they'll probably bring boats back, like, back, like, on the first map that they had. Uh, maybe even, like, a skidoo kind of a thing. Like, a jet ski, I mean, sorry. Like, a jet ski would be kind of a cool vehicle, but I'm not sure. Um, I wanted to point out real quick that this is, like, a 6x6 six six map if these squares are a 1,000 kilometers. Uh, so, it's going to be a lot, like, the size of a kindy, uh, a PUBG. Um, but if you look, there's not that many compounds, like there's like little compound here and here, but for the most part, it seems like a lot of like the compounds are in like big areas, like big areas you got to fight. Um, so maybe they're trying to like, uh, get people to fight more at the start of the match should be my guess, something like that. Like up here, there's a good amount of compounds and over here, but, but, uh, overall, like there's not like a bunch of little compounds throughout here that you can go loot. Like over here, there's a big hole. And uh, over here is a huge hole. So I think that like, maybe they're trying to get more people to get involved in early gauge engagements, which would be kind of cool. Um, there's a big cargo ship here, kind of a cool change as well. Um, uh, another thing I kind of wanted to point out is that some of the islands don't have bridges off of them. So like this one doesn't have any bridges. Uh, this one has one bridge. Like this one only has the one bridge that goes to two other islands. There's not one that connects here or anything. At least, uh, if this is the final picture, I'm not sure if it is or not, but um, that kind of makes for like an interesting play dynamic for bridge camping. It's a good way to get some free loot or to get in more engagements if they're pushing for more engagements. So um, overall, I think it's cool. I think the game needed something new. We all were wanting the new map to come out soon, or the uh, the old map to be released. And I think this was kind of a shock. Everyone was not really expecting like this kind of map, and uh, some people on Reddit are even upset about it, but. Overall, I think that it'll it'll definitely bring more content to the game, which I think it needs right now. A lot of people are kind of getting tired of the snow map, and maybe this will bring some more people back to the game so the queue times won't be so long, at least in NA. I know that they're a little bit longer. So uh, I just kind of want to let make this video real quick and give my opinion on it. Um, overall, like what could happen with like the lava, the new class, how there's not as many compounds just kind of spread throughout, so a lot more probably early game fighting and uh, more risky drops. And then I kind of wanted to just point out that a lot of uh, these islands don't have bridges, so you'll probably have to be fighting on the bridges if you want to get across, unless you can swim. But I'm not sure how fast swimming uh, is as an alternative. It kind of looks like down here, there's a lot of uh, islands. And like or the, on this island, there's a, quite a few buildings. So these two might be kind of a fun place to drop if you're not looking for hot drops. but. Yeah, uh, overall impressions, I'm stoked. I'm stoked to see it. They're, they're estimating that it's going to come out either the end of this month or the before the middle of February is what I've been reading. So um, I hope that's the case. We can get some new experience on a new map. And 
Uh, if you like the video, thank you guys so much. Don't be afraid to subscribe. Um, I also stream on Twitch all the time, twitch.tv slash Kodak the Wolf. Uh, I play with viewers quite a bit, and I like to meet new people. So uh, don't be afraid to say hello. And uh, thank you guys. Hope you have fun watching my video. Take it easy.